So this is an announcement that I personally have wanted out of Square Enix for quite a long period of time. But ladies and gentlemen, the Kingdom Hearts franchise is finally coming to PC. Announced today on February 11th that Kingdom Hearts 1.5 2.5 Kingdom Hearts 2.8, Kingdom Hearts 3, and Kingdom Hearts Melody of Memory are all at long last finally coming to PC. And to make this even better, the games are coming March 30th, which is honestly not far away at all. However, before you get a little too excited, there are some things that you should note. First and foremost, this is an Epic Game Store exclusive, meaning for all of you rushing to Steam looking for a pre-order page, you're not gonna find it. Which I already can imagine is going to make some of you quite angry, as Epic Game Store exclusives are somewhat notorious at this point. Another sticking point for many of you is going to be the price tag. Looking at the price tag listed right now, Kingdom Hearts 1.5 plus 2.5 is currently listed at $50. Kingdom Hearts 2.8 KH3 and Melody of Memory are all listed at $60. I mean, at the very least, at least Kingdom Hearts 3 includes Remind, right? While fans have long wanted PC ports for these games, the price tag is honestly a little bit too high in my opinion. I mean, Kingdom Hearts 1.5, 2.5 are basically a collection of PlayStation 2 games. And technically, they're not even a new collection of PlayStation 2 games. Both 1.5 and 2.5 have both technically existed since the PlayStation 3, so releasing these games at full price is kind of weird. Because if you want to rebuy all these games on PC, it's going to run you about $230 for games that most of you likely already own and have already purchased on more than one occasion. That being said, the price for PC games goes down all the time, there's constantly sales, and if you're willing to be patient, you'll be able to snag the games for a much more reasonable price. But uh, for $230? Well, I'll at least get Kingdom Hearts 1.5 2.5 on day one, that's for sure. As many of you know, Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix being one of my favorite games of all time. I'm also willing to bet that these games will eventually come to Steam at some point, but right now they're Epic Game Store exclusives because, let's be honest, developers pay a lot less in royalties whenever their games are on the Epic Game Store, especially for games that are built on Unreal Engine 4, which basically sees any Unreal Engine royalties waived. Though I'm willing to bet that this is a time deal, and eventually these games will come to Steam, but you will have to be patient for them. Aside from this, I am really excited to see the modding opportunities that people will have with the games. I mean, people have already done some crazy unofficial mods with Kingdom Hearts 2, so now that we have a PC port and they can truly fool around with stuff, the mods for the PC ports of this game are what have me the most excited. Like I've seen mods for Kingdom Hearts 2, such as playing as Vanitas and someone even trying to remake like Kingdom Hearts 3. 358 over two days inside of it. Dude, there's like a lot of crazy stuff. And now that they're on PC, they're not even doing like console mods. They're doing something official that everyone can legitimately play. The stuff that they're going to do is just going to be absolutely incredible. And that's the number one takeaway from this for me is that we're finally going to be able to have Kingdom Hearts games that we can mod and just sort of be able to do whatever the community wants with them. So I'm really excited to see what kind of content is going to come out of that for the years to come. But Ultima, with all of that said, I want to know what you think. Are you excited about Kingdom Hearts coming to PC? And are you really excited about those mods? Subscribe, click the bell icon, and let me know in the comments below. Shout out to Patron Pragmatic and the rest of the Ultima community.